Will mango cream actually lead to a low blood sugar spike compared to having just mango? Let's find out. Welcome to the first ever fruit improvement series, where I'll be pairing fruits with different types of food items to see if they can actually bring down the sugar spike. To kick off this series, today I'm having mango cream made with 250 grams safeda mango and 40 grams fresh cream. Importantly, this whipped cream does not have any sugar in it. In total, this should be around 270 calories. Let's see what happens. This was good. Let's see what my glucose monitor says. 25 mg increase. Look at this amazing result. For comparison, when I had the same 250 grams safeda mango, but on its own, my blood sugar levels had increased by 40 mg. This is only 25. It's 40% lesser. That's a lot. This happened because fresh cream is very rich in fats. It's almost 25% fat. And as we've seen, fats tend to slow down the release of glucose into the bloodstream. And that's exactly what happened here. Of course, I do need to remember that adding cream increases the calories. Because 250 grams mangoes on their own were around 160 to 170 calories. Whereas with whipped cream, they almost doubled to 300 calories. So all I need to do is reduce the portion size, which is fine because cream actually makes it richer also. And because of that, in fact, I'll benefit from a spike lower than this also. From now on, mango with cream. 